Hey, what's up guys? This is Syphic back again. Just thought I'd do another little video for you guys. Um, when I'm usually out thrifting or looking for video game stuff, I also, you know, find other things as well. Or I kind of like look out for certain things that look kind of cool. Um, for instance, I uh, was at a flea market and I saw these action figures here. Um, looks like they're, uh, I've kind of looked around on the internet and I guess these are the Sota Street Fighter 2 action figures. I've got uh, Chun Li here. I've got uh, Ken, however he is missing his uh, little belt. I've got uh, Blanca here and Cami. I paid two bucks for all of these with the exception of the Blanca which they charged me three bucks I guess because he's bigger. Um, and then I also picked up the Ultimate Warrior for a buck. Was at another th uh, flea market, and I picked. I thought they were games at first, but well, they are games. But I thought they were video games. But it turns out they're like a card game called Car Wars. And I picked these up. Uh, these were a buck each. This was uh, kind of neat. I'm not sure uh, how the game works, but I picked them up anyway for a dollar. Came with this one. Uh, came with uh, Sunday Drivers, uh, Truck Stop, uh, GEV, and uh, I guess this one is called Ogre. And these all say Steve Jackson games on them. So those were kind of neat. Picked those up for a buck. Um, then I did pick up uh, for three bucks the My So Called Life box set. Um, and it is new, and the lady just wanted three dollars for it. Well, all DVDs were three bucks, and I'm not sure why she didn't charge me more for this one. Um, it's new. The discs have never been played, and when you open it up, it comes with uh, my so-called life book. And um, let me pull this out here, and back there are the movies. And as you can see, they're all in there. So that was pretty neat. That was three bucks. And then I picked these up as well. I'm not sure where this one is from, but uh, it's a little lion with some character on it. It does say Bandai, and I got this for two bucks. Um, it says Bandai, uh, looks like uh, 1998. If anyone knows what that's from, let me know. And then I picked up this Voltron lion. Um, it's missing a few pieces, the ears and the tail and stuff like that. But I picked it up anyway. I think this was a dollar. Yeah, it's a buck. And then I also picked up the green lion, but I can't seem to find it in the mess that I have here. So, uh, but uh, it was the green one as well, and unfortunately not, none of the other ones were there. Then I picked these up as well. Uh, I, I put them in little baggies. I freaking thought these were amazing. They're Karate Kid figures. I got Mr. Miyagi, got Daniel's son, got Johnny, got, uh, I'm not sure who the hell that is, but I think he may be from the cartoon. Uh, Sato, uh, I got another Daniel's son, which is dressed kind of weird. Got the referee, and another weird Johnny. These were $2 each, so I picked those up. Uh, I'm gonna keep those. Those are really, really cool. And I love the Karate Kid movie, so that was awesome. And, uh, also, for ten bucks, I picked up these Jordans here. I'm not sure if they're real. I doubt it. I'm pretty sure they're probably replicas or maybe the Chinese knockoffs. But these were ten bucks, and they're in amazing shape. They're missing shoelaces, but uh, they're, like, almost brand spanking new. Uh, maybe Green January out there knows if these are real or not. I know he's a Jordan collector and stuff. But uh, for ten bucks, whether they're fake or not, it's so pretty neat. Uh, maybe I'll match my Gumby shirt. But uh, just showing you guys some of the other stuff that I find out there as well. It's not always just video game related. I do find a lot of cool little toys and stuff like that. So most of the stuff might go up on eBay or up for trades, or maybe I'll just keep some of the stuff. But definitely keeping the Karate Kid stuff. But um, just thought I'd do a quick video. Uh -huh. And I'll show you guys some other stuff. I also buy a lot of records too, so I've found some pretty neat records as well, but too many to show in a video. So until next time, you guys take care, and this is Syphic once again signing out. Take care, guys. Lights.